welcome back to my channel so this video is going to be really quick it's just something that i really wanted to touch on about something that a lot of women are doing all i can say is to each his own but i still need to shed some light on this because i'm just here to share some information so as a woman some of us not me sometimes we experience things like yeast infections bv bacterial vaginosis and a lot of other discomforts down there and um we tend to want to insert things in our vagina right and when women ask me i always say personally i do not recommend inserting anything in your vagina not a suppository the douching the pearls none of that if you're having an issue down there i always say start from inside the body internal care whatever it is that you can insert inside the vagina you should be able to ingest it and it works from inside out but a lot of women are using boric acid to help with yeast infections and other things and they get results it works however one thing a lot of women don't understand about boric acid is it kills the bad bacteria but it also kills the good bacteria and you need a balance of good and bad bacteria in your vagina and when it wipes out everything you're gonna eventually get other issues and it could be a recurring problem of having yeast infections and so forth if you're killing out everything down there that's why i always tell women i do not recommend inserting anything up in your vagina and i definitely do not recommend or support the use of boric acid i just don't a lot of women might disagree with me and that's fine but i don't recommend it because i know what it does if you are really trying to heal yourself and get rid of any bacterial infections or issues down there I definitely recommend using herbs from the inside out. I even recommend steaming, yoni steaming. Uh, there's so many other things you can do holistically to heal yourself. But one of the biggest things that we're all not willing to do is change our diet. If you are having an issue with yeast infections, you are definitely ingesting too much yeast or food that causes yeast or food that feeds yeast. So the breads the pastas the carbs the cookies the cakes the cupcakes the coffee like those things are going to affect every woman differently but the way it's affecting you might just be a reoccurring yeast infection you have to start taking a deeper look of what you're putting in your body and how that is affecting your womb health and your feminine health overall i think i pretty much made my point but um, i just want to reiterate why i don't recommend inserting anything in your vagina like i said a lot of women might disagree with me but i don't even recommend using the the, the menstrual cup i don't recommend that either i don't recommend tampons whether it's toxic or non-toxic or cotton i don't care i don't it doesn't matter which one i don't recommend those either because it literally goes against the natural process of your menstrual cycle okay the blood is supposed to flow down and out it's not supposed to be staying in and soaked up by a tissue like there is a lot of things that if we just sit down and think about it you realize it goes against nature so much that it could be the cause of a lot of other issues that we're having in our life one of the simplest things that you can do to have a better menstrual cycle and have a more painless um, period every month is to wear cotton pads whether it's the disposable cotton toxic free pads or the reusable cotton toxic free pads whichever way you want to go but make your period so much better every month and you will see you are literally going to see the results trust me i'm not just speaking like that is the journey that i took like i've made all these changes in my life and that's why i can sit here today and tell you that it works at the end of the day i'm just the messenger so and a lot of women already know this information but they, there's always there's always this thing where it's like oh I know but no there's no but you're either going to know better and do better or you're gonna know better and not do better than deal with the consequences later on in life 
that's your choice. I hope you all enjoyed this video. To all of my melanated women out there watching, protect your wombs by any means necessary. And to everyone watching, protect your peace by any means necessary. I wish you all love, light, and prosperity. And you will see me in my next video. Peace.